Rameltion is a drug used to promote sleep. It works as an agonist of melatonin receptors. In this video, I'll share my visual mnemonic to help you remember all the information about Rameltion for test day. Let's get into our scene, shall we? It looks like we're at a restaurant and it's lunchtime. Mmm, those ramen noodles look delicious. Speaking of, let this ramen remind us of Rameltion. Get it? Since ramen sounds like Rameltion? A nice bowl of Rameltion ramen. Rameltion is a drug that is used to promote sleep. Let's explore the rest of this scene to learn about how Rameltion works. After you finish your meal at this ramen restaurant, they help you clear your palate by serving you a nice slice of melon for dessert. By the way, let this melon remind us of melatonin, since melon sounds like melatonin, right? This melon is here to help you remember that Rameltion is an agonist at melatonin receptors. Specifically, Rameltion binds to the melatonin receptors MT1 and MT2. In the suprachiasmatic nucleus of the hypothalamus, it basically mimics the activity of melatonin by binding to those receptors, which should be easy to remember since the mel of melatonin is literally in the name ra mel -tion. Just remember this melon for melatonin, okay? All right, we're almost done with our scene here. Let's talk about our last symbol. It looks like our customer ate too much ramen and is now falling asleep from a food coma. This one is pretty easy to remember because Rameltion promotes sleep, which is what our customer is doing. Rameltion is therefore used to treat insomnia and other disorders of poor sleep. But you probably already knew that melatonin induces sleep, right? So, once more, this guy falling asleep in his food coma should remind us of Rameltion's use in promoting sleep. Finally, before we close, there are just a few adverse effects of Rameltion that we should know. These include some nonspecific symptoms, such as dizziness, nausea, fatigue, and headaches. These effects are pretty low yield for test day, but it's still good to be aware of them. Finally, it's worth noting that unlike some other hypnotics like benzodiazepines, Rameltion does not cause dependence and is not a controlled substance. This makes it relatively safer to use compared to other sleep-inducing drugs. Again, this isn't a super high yield point, but it's still good to be aware of for test day. Alright, all this talk about ramen is making me hungry. I'm going to get my hands on a bowl for lunch. But first, let's wrap up. Rameltion is a drug used to promote sleep. It is an agonist of melatonin receptors in the suprachiasmatic nucleus of the hypothalamus. By inducing sleep, Rameltion is useful as a hypnotic for the treatment of insomnia. There's a few nonspecific side effects of Rameltion, including dizziness, nausea, fatigue, and headaches. Finally, Rameltion does not cause dependence, so it's generally safer to use compared to other sleep-promoting drugs like benzodiazepines. Time for me to eat some ramen, and I'll catch up with you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching! For more videos like this one, subscribe to our channel and check out our newest lessons. For more resources on this topic, including fact lists and interactive review images, click the image next to the More Here arrow. I'll see you next time.